All right, now on example B, look at what's different. Would you turn and talk to your neighbor? What's different about this problem than example A? Turn and talk. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, uh, Nick, tell me what's different about, or Jacob, tell me what's different about example B versus A. It has a negative number instead of positive. All right. Did you guys hear that clearly? Yes. Here we go. So we're going to handle this no differently than we did in example A. I'm going to do the inverse operation. The opposite of adding or subtraction is adding. I'm ahead of myself there. So here I go. I am adding a negative 6. Notice, I am not changing the negative 6. Negative 6 stays the same. I don't reverse the sign. Let me rewrite that negative 6. There we go. Negative 6 stays the same. What I am doing is the opposite of subtraction. It is addition. Preguntas? Questions? Okay. I didn't have to do this. Some of you guys may elect not to. Okay? I am going to rewrite what I have up here left to right, like a book. X minus negative 6 plus negative 6. Questions on where I got that from? That's one side of the equal symbol. On the other side of the equal sign is 24 plus negative 6. Peach. Bueno, here we go. I am going to show you the zero pair. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I am going to show you sign changes. Sign changes on subtraction becoming addition. X, instead of subtracting out of 6, I'm going to add positive 6. And I have the rest of this problem. You may need a moment to copy that into your notebook. Go for that. All I did here was sign changes. So here I am in my Cornell notes. zero sum. The zero pair, that is. Positive 6 and negative 6 makes zero. One number adding its opposite makes zero. So now I have x plus zero on one side of the equal, and over here I have 24 plus a negative 6. Are there questions about the zero pair? It's very clear, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. On this side of the equal is simply x. x plus 0 is x. And then on the other side, when you have two integers of different signs, positive versus a negative, you are really going to subtract. So 24 good guys battling six bad guys. Okay? Six bad guys die, but they're also going to take out six good guys from here, leaving you with 18 good guys. The answer is positive, oh. Avery, because 24 is a larger integer than 6. It's signed with positive, so 18 positive. So 18 positive.